All right. All right. Here we go. Um, Carl Shoemaker with Action Coach here. I'm joined by Tim Sullivan. Uh, Tim's with the incredible uh, CPA firm of Scheidel Sullivan and Lanny. That's right. Uh, here in New Jersey. And, um, you know, I'm so happy to have Tim on because CPAs, um, it's just such an important professional. And, and so, so much skill is required. And I, I've used um, all these guys in, within the firm as a source for information when my clients are having a questions about things like tax planning and taxes and, and PPP and a whole lot of other things. So it's really great um, to have a chance to chat with Tim a little bit and perhaps to have him kind of talk about you know, what they do and how they work with clients. So Tim, go ahead. Why don't you tell everybody about yourself and about your firm? Well, I'm a CPA here in Ramsey, New Jersey. Uh, I'm a partner in the firm of Chanel Sullivan Lanny, CPA LLC. Uh, we're located in Ramsey. Um, we handle uh, everything from individual to business. Uh, most of our clients are closely held family businesses. Uh, people are involved in day-to-day -day transactions. The family members handle things from uh, anything involved in the business. Uh, we, we assist with bookkeeping, we assist with tax planning, uh, tax preparation, financial statements if they need financial statements, guidance on financing, buying and selling, bringing in partners, uh, buying properties, selling properties, all things, that, you know, things like that. So lots of different types of businesses, right? It doesn't, yes. it doesn't well, I mean, we have businesses, you know, I, I think I told you, Carl, whether you sell widgets or whether you're in service, uh, a lot of these business owners have the same problems. So many, many people think they're very, you know, oh, it's original to my business, um, but it's not. Many, many business owners have the same problems uh, and we're here to help them with those problems. Right. Interesting that, that people think that they have some kind of unique problem when, um, it really, if there's a common thread around the world, it's that it, it problems are the best way to solve a problem, I guess, is to talk to an expert, um, you know, find somebody who's probably dealt with that problem that yep. you think is so unique, and they probably dealt with it a whole bunch of times. So tax planning, right? That's, that's interesting. And people, they don't do enough of it, do they? No, and that, that's one thing that I always talk to people when we meet with somebody for the first time, what differentiates our firm from another firm? Um, and where do we provide value? Where we can provide a, a good source of value for somebody, they always wanna maximize their professional dollar, their professional fee dollar. And one of the things that we can do for you is assist them with tax planning and tax preparation, tax planning in particular. Uh, and it's not just a... December 1st to December 30th, you know, try and cram as much into the, the end of the year as possible. It's planning throughout the year, um, trying to maximize your dollars, you know, the, the money that you put in your pocket. Um, and things happen all, all times during the year. Um, you need new employees. Uh, you lay off employees. You can, you can find a, a building. Should you buy a building? Should you rent a building? Um, how do the, the nuances of these play out in your in your bottom line tax dollars? How, how many uh, you know? How much am I going to save from a from a transaction? And it's funny that a lot of times people think that something will save them tax dollars. For example, buying a building, but you really you have to buy a building. You have to amortize a building over a depreciated building over thirty nine and a half years. A commercial property. So if you buy it dollar for dollar, you're not going to write it off all in one year. Uh, another uh, thing that people constantly ask is someone passes away and they get an inheritance and how much money are they going to have to put away for that inheritance? And the answer is zero. You know, the, the inheritance is yours 100%. You don't have to pay any tax on that. If there are taxes that have to be paid, the estate would pay the taxes. And whatever the person gets is, is their money. So I, I, I guess what I'm hearing out of that, a lot of people are make a bunch of assumptions as opposed to, you know, coming to see you guys or picking up the phone and, and calling to say, you know, can, can you help me with this? Um, that, is, that, is that basically your experience? 
Yeah, um, it's funny. Some people are. Some people will call. You know, some of my clients call me weekly. Some of them call me monthly. Some of them call me once a year. It depends on a particular person. No one strategy is right or wrong. It's just how that person feels. If they feel comfortable calling me, they can call me. Uh, we always want to be in the loop. We like to be one of the, you know, one of the people in the inner circle, you know, that we understand the transaction. We know the worst thing to do with your accountant or a professional is to go through a transaction and then tell them after everything is done. Oh, by the way, I did this this year. And then now we're having to go backwards and, and maybe fix something that should have been, that, that didn't have to be broken to fix. Right, right. So the proactive planning part. Absolutely. So that, that kind of uh, kind of brings me to my, my thinking about, you know, what's an, what's an ideal client for you? Is it, is it some... uh, someone that knows uh, where their shortfalls are, you know, a successful person or, or has a great idea, knows that they have maybe have some shortfalls in finance, you know, finances or accounting or taxes, and they know that they need some help with that, uh, sits down, tells us what it is that they are looking to do and what they're trying to get out of, out of us and, and what they're looking to us for guidance. And then somebody who actually listens to the advice and and <laughs> uses our advice and uh, and does something positive. So they can really, you know, potentially save a lot of money and or avoid a lot of problems. Correct. And you know, both are good things, right? Well, I joke around all the time and I say going to your accountant is like going to your dentist. You really should go regularly. <laughs> but <laughs> no. Painful and it can be expensive. Right. right. But the alternative, but I always like to think, you know, great professional services, people are kind of like, they really help you avoid making fatal mistakes in a business. Yeah. And I've seen, you know, as in my um, life in business and especially as a business coach, I've seen business owners just make some, you know, really, you know, colossal mistakes, which are, they, you know, they say, a wise man learns from his mistakes, or no, a smart man learns from his mistakes. A, lie, a wise man learns from the mistakes of others. And and gosh, you know, you want to learn from the mistakes of others, go to a tax pro who's seen a lot of other people make mistakes and can help you avoid them. So, yeah. um, I mean, that's why we like to be involved in the beginning where we can see the steps, you know, implement the plan, follow the steps, you know, listen, things happen during the year, you know, even the best, uh, the best laid plan, something can happen at the end of the year and, and, uh, and uh, blow it up. Um, but nine times out of 10, that's not going to happen. You know, the, the, the old adage, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. That definitely is true in the tax world and the accounting world. Great. So, all right, that's that's great stuff. And I, I guess what, you know, maybe the, what's the best thing for people to do? I mean, you, you guys are easy to get to. You're right in Ramsey. Sure. Um, if somebody's got questions about, you know, if wanting to ask for your- anything, The first thing they could do, you know, if they, if they don't want to call, they could go to a website, uh, sslcpallc.com. Uh, there's a lot of information on there. You can look and, and try and find some things on there. Um, and then take the next step and just give us a call. You could talk to me. You could talk to one of my partners, David Scheidel or Mike Lanny, and they'd be happy to help as well. I mean, we're, uh, you know, contrary to popular belief, we're not, you know, we want people to do better. We want to help people out. That's really, you know, I don't sit here and crunch numbers all day. You know, that we're, we're trying to formulate plans and, and help people maximize tax dollars. And, and you know, it's nice too. It's in our firm. Uh, you know, Mike and Dave and I have a, a, uh, a relationship where we bounce ideas off one another. And I think that's, uh, again, one of the value added things for our firm is that, you know, if I don't have a particular answer, or if I know I may have an answer, I may have a thought, I walk down the hall, I could talk to Dave or Mike and, you know, run some things by them. And I, and I get either assurances that what I thought is correct and they agree with me, or they may see something from a different angle and say, have you thought about this or have you thought about that? 
Great, great. So SSLCPALLC.com. Yes, sir. All right, great. I'll tag that onto the, this video. And what's what's the best phone number that people could call? Uh, they call us at 201-236-2226. I'll add that in as well. So that's great. So Tim Sullivan, Scheidel Sullivan and Lanny, uh, business owners, and, and you do individual 1040s too, right? So yes. So you know, people we are everything from a simple tax return to multi-state, you know, filing in multiple states for different, you know, for people who have uh, either income or uh, or assets in multiple states. Great, I can attest to this to uh, all all of the these guys. They're really easy to talk to. Um, it, you know, if you've got questions about your business and how to how to plan and how to minimize your tax burden and how to do things the right way, pick up the phone, make a phone call, have a chat. Uh, Shidel Sullivan and Lanny, talk to these guys and and find out what the right thing to do for you is. So, great, it was good talking to you, Tim. Thank you very much. Appreciate, I appreciate it. Thanks.